<laughs> what is up YouTube and all my fish keeping friends? How is everybody doing out there in fish tank land? This is a little sneak peek of everything going on in the house. Amber's doing laundry right now outside of the house while we work on the washer and dryer. But um, we're just getting a lot of things together around here. There's a lot of work to do. It's kind of why there hasn't been a lot of content lately. Just trying to get things settled. There's a big echo in this room because it's pretty empty. Uh, this is, uh, is my office space. You see uh, stuff I got going on. I got new lights that, uh, that I recently purchased. Thank you to all of my members and my Patreon for all of your support because I wouldn't be able to, I would not have been able to get that without you. Um, I had to literally give away my monitors to friends. I didn't even sell them. I just gave them away. And I, uh, you know, from my, this last contract, I took some of the money from that and, uh, and, and got some new monitors. And I kind of got this stuff set up on a folding table right now, but I put some, uh, I got a whiteboard that I put on here. It's like a sticky roll on whiteboard thing. You know, like roll it, it sticks to the wall. And I got that going on so I can kind of start organizing things. So this area will be like backstage. And uh, I plan on really having some fun with some tanks and stuff over here against these two walls. And just really utilize that space. Uh, for tanks. So obviously yeah, I'm just getting settled. I'm working on building out a desk. Um, I do have a plan to make a desk. I got some stuff in the garage that I'm working on. I've been like collecting stuff. Vermont is crazy cool because people literally like, I don't know, I've been in the island for too long maybe, but they're like this college town and there's literally like people just leave little free signs free on the side of the road like cool furniture and stuff like that so I've been collecting some cool furniture and maybe I, uh, well I'm not gonna run to the garage and show you that now but in the end uh, I plan on doing a little bit of a video and show you guys how I set up my new uh, like streaming interview table and just for you know my editing base so I can you know you know produce edit content and live stream from here and have a little bit of fun with that so um, I'm gonna take you guys on a little bit of a tour around the house, just a couple of things. Um, we gotta be careful because uh, we're still working on stuff. We're trying to wanna just, you know, we gotta get some stuff put together before we share everything. Um, it's all a work in progress, a lot, a lot of work. So let me go ahead and go downstairs real quick. Pothos, the land of pothos for sure. And of course the living room's going on. I'm not gonna get into the tanks. The tanks are all off right now, but I love this little spot. Look at this cute little spot that Amber set up. I love this. I can't help this one. I, I love these little lights. These lights are so cool. And I just like them like half lit. Like look at that fish art. It's so cute. This is a perfect little like book nook. Look at that pothos. And uh, my my jacket, my ugly jacket in the way of the, the shot. But um, just a cute little spot. So it's like a little comfy spot. You just wanna like hang out here. Got a little fish art behind you. A nice glow of light. Nice place to read a book, watch the fish breed on the wall behind you. Um, really pretty. I think she did a really awesome job. I'm very, very, very proud of her for sure on all of the hard work and just putting this all together. It's it's very, very impressive. Um, I love that painting. Isn't that cool though? Really, really cool painting. Uh, so I'm gonna keep it short and sweet. I don't wanna get in trouble because Amber's not right. She's doing a little laundry right now and I just wanted to like just give you a little peek. Now we got a lot going on in the basement. That's gonna be like our main grow out area. And I don't really wanna share all of that right off the bat. Well, it's not there yet. We're working on it. We're building this out, obviously. And we will create some like builds and stuff to kind of like show you what we go through to build to build it out, you know, stuff like that. But in the end, um, I'm working on, she like kind of like let me have this whole lab space and I'm loving it. I just wanted to show you guys what I'm doing down here real quick. This is like the first, real sneak peek of anything going on down here and um, I had to wait a while to get down here she worked really hard to put this all together and uh, it's all torn apart right now I know it looks like a mess but I wanted you guys to get a little bit of an idea of you know just the process um, you know she started on uh, painting these white and it, you know it's a really long project uh, I used to be a professional painter well I, I worked for a professional painter let's put it that way and I got uh, you know got some tips and tricks up my sleeve from that so um, it's a big daunting task to redo cabinets so I jumped in and I said let me help you with it because look at this that's a great idea I mean there's a good idea to go white because it's gonna make it look really nice this is gonna be a lab space so I have all of the cabinet doors laid out I've been painting them I gotta do like three coats I mean it was wood before it would have been wood grain but 
laboratory we want nice and clean and white and I love the green look at what she did I love what she did with the green in here um, we're still working on stuff I don't want to give anything away whole other room over there I can't share with you and I don't want to we got some stuff to do this is super super exciting I'm really 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 excited about this uh, it's just gonna take some time to put it together and make it all happen it's to me like I've always said before it's all about the journey not the destination I love the creation of this putting this together making it making it happen uh, just kind of like the engineering and and whatnot but um, this is gonna be really fun uh, so I look forward to being able to do something in this space I really want to put a um, a laminar flow hood which is more of like a, a clean space if anybody uh, uh, if you if you don't know what a flam a laminar flow hood is it's really just kind of like a clean lab space it, you can kind of like HEPA filter air and whatnot so I can work with uh, tissue culture cloning I really would like to do uh, really get into tissue culture cloning just for the fun of it I just it's a challenge of mine and I'd love to be able to share that with you guys so really get into the chemistry of it and stuff like that so I plan on kind of creating my laminar flow hood, kind of like a, an area, a real clean airspace to work in here. And then down here below where there used to be a, um, a range here, a, a stove and oven and whatnot, whatnot, I want to go ahead and do grow out here for all of the, the specimens, all the little cups of different cultures and gel and stuff like that. Um, one thing I will share with you that's coming up. I don't really want to give it away because it's not even ready. In this little room, this room has some secrets, some secrets, some secrets within it. The the the, the room under the stairs is 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 got some stuff, and we're gonna have to get into that. We will have to talk about it, but it, I can't really share it with you. But just keep in mind, um, there's some there's some stuff under the stairs, and, and we really are gonna have to talk about it. Um, uh, yeah, I'm a little jittered out. I'm working on my second pot of coffee, halfway through my second pot of coffee. Uh, but this will be a really cool, am I, am I zoomed out? This is going to be a really cool, really cool lab space. I'll be able to keep my microscope probably up here in one of these cabinets. And I'll be able to work on it on this clean space here, with the laminar flow hood. Um, just some fun stuff, fun stuff. So that's just a little bit of a sneak peek of what's going on in the fish laboratory. Now we will obviously, we'll be working not with just plants, we're gonna be working with the fish that we're working with. It'll be an opportunity for us to take a little closer look, be able to do uh, necropsy and just see what's going on with some of these fish. If we do have some issue, you know, coming in, you know, dealing with wild caught fish and um, parasites and stuff like that. Uh, but like, look at this rack setup for, <laughs> Amber is awesome, I mean, <laughs> she's ready for war she is ready for war you come down the stairs grab a net get to work you know what I mean it's pretty cool stuff so I just want to give you guys just a little sneak peek of stuff going on here I want to sit down and edit I'm just trying to get like my desk space I'm just kind of nesting a little bit spending some time with Amber getting to know the town um, I'm loving the food I'm telling you the honey the milk the eggs all the dairy products the meats the air is clean it is a beautiful place. I have to say Vermont has got it going on and it's really been an awesome experience so far. And I, I'm happy to be able to share more of it with you in the future. We'll see what's going on. So let me get back to work. I got to finish painting all of these and get them going and get them hung up on here. And that's going to be good. And I'm going to move on to another color in here and we're just going to tighten this up. We can get these floor, fle the clean, the floors clean, and then we're gonna move on to starting racks and stuff like that, and we'll share all of that with you guys. So thank you guys so much for watching. I really do appreciate that. Keep your, uh, you know, keep a lookout for content over on Amber's channel. Uh, some fish room tours of stuff going on upstairs as well. Just a little bit closer look on some of the tanks. But thank you guys so much. I appreciate everything. Thank you to all my. Patreons, all of my members, to all of you out there, all of you that comment, like, share my content, all that. It means so, so much to me. Thank you so very much. And uh, just, you know, keep a lookout for new content. I'm going to start rocking and rolling it here soon enough. But, but thank you guys so much. And remember, keep your tanks clean, your fish fed, and have fun.